This video was sponsored by EA Game Changers. Yeehaw! Welcome back to Build It With Smith. I'm your host Smith, and this is the best cowboy hat I could find. Well, we're gearing up for the contest of mayor's season with this Wild West theme. Get ready for the Wild West where you can compete and uh, unlock exclusive buildings when you participate in the contest of mayor's season. Join in now to receive the Wild West Town Hall building after the season has started. Compete each week and climb the ranks to unlock more rewards. All right, so we just tap here at the Contest of Mayor's building. Let's clear that out and look and see what building they have, exclusive buildings for this season. So let's take a look at each one. We've got the Wild West Town Hall for a 20% boost. And we've got the Horseshoe Stables for a 25% population boost. Uh, the Little Schoolhouse, 30% population boost. And we've got the Cowboy Bank, 40% uh, population boost there. And then we've got the Sheriff's Office, 50% uh, population boost. And let's see the last one that uh, when you get to the Megapolis League, you got the Sarsaparilla a saloon for 70 percent population boost so that's pretty hefty uh once you get up to that level get in that 70 percent population boost make sure you place that building in front of a lot of buildings uh like this group here so that you get a big population boost now thanks to ea and the exclusive game changers program they granted me and they saw fit to give me exclusive access to these buildings so i can show them to y'all so let's see, uh, I believe that they're under the entertainment and we'll scroll, 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 and there they are. Uh, so there's the Wild West Town Hall. Oh, so check this out. Uh, I guess I didn't notice, but uh, the population uh, data layers are kind of like long long ways you know kind of like the beach items where they get a lot of coverage a narrow coverage so that's good that'll probably be good you know for like a group of buildings like i have over there with those uh gambling buildings although it really wouldn't make sense to put a wild west next to gambling in my opinion uh but there are some ideas i'm coming up with uh if you've lived in, ever lived in some cities where they have like a historic district kind of like the central place where the city first got started a lot of the older homes they may have turned to uh, little shops and stuff like that and so it's kind of like a an old town feel to it I could probably do something like that with these groups of buildings I don't know there's a lot of dust flying around also but I guess that makes sense with the theme and everything else Sarsara I'll, I'll uh, have to go and get a better uh, pronunciation of that on the next video but well they all look pretty nice all right so let's check out this uh little game that they have here the happy spring holiday i don't know if that's the official name of it but oh here they go with these uh we've got the blooming hill uh the fast track to spring these bunny rabbits guys are doing the most uh the egg twirl and the bunny go round <laughs> their eyes are so big I don't know but uh, anyway well uh, how do we get started with this here um, all right so maybe we click here no produce then collect all right so this guy wants us to produce and collect an ice cream sandwich for 80 eggs or 80 rewards or something like that that we could put towards our spin however celebrate eggtastic spring uh, see, so we can actually claim 500 of these uh, eggs or points or whatever uh, that we need to get started. So, uh, for a limited time, get collectible uh, buildings. So, let's go ahead and go back to that screen we were at. Actually, I think we click on this. This uh, says five days, 16 hours. I think we click there. And now we have 500 points to get started. So let's play. I hope to get, uh, what do I hope to get? I don't want any regular items. Is that maybe that fast track might be pretty neat. Some entertainment for the kids. 
Let's see, we're close. We are passed up. Ah. Uh, this ain't gonna help me out none. Uh, that's trash. Well, I guess we got to try to do some more uh, things here. So let's see. Click on where this is, and I'm gonna go to show me. All right, so it takes us to the fast food restaurant where we actually don't have the items to uh, to complete this. Now, let me just say, you can't go and buy these things from the uh, uh, Trade HQ. It's not going to work. You have to produce and collect them in order for this to count. So it's kind of a grind, but if you like any of those huge bunny rabbits with the eyes or any of those items, uh, hey, go for it. And thanks for watching. Uh, check out my next video as I continue to expand my town. See you next time.